The Stanford Prison Experiment was funded by the U.S. Office of Naval Research, and I'm going to let you hear Philip Zimbardo in his own words here explain how it all came together. Take a listen. Our goal back in 1971 was to study the behavioral and psychological consequences of becoming a prisoner or prison guard. To do this, we decided to simulate a prison environment, both physically and mentally, and then observe the effects of this institution on all those within its walls. We used the basement of the psychology building to stage our little drama, scheduled to run for two weeks. A card of small offices was converted into a functional prison environment. It was complete with three cells, there was a guard's room, the warden's office, my superintendent's office, and a closet used if necessary for solitary confinement. We recruited the help of some prison experts to assist us with our prison design and construction. Foremost among them was Carlo Prescott, an ex-convict recently released from serving 17 years behind bars in San Quentin and Soledad prisons. 